Since 1964, Literacy Advance has been transforming lives and communities through the doorway of literacy. Hello, I'm Michael Bybee. Welcome to Comcast Newsmakers On Location. I thought I'd start out with a question. And here's the question. If you think about all the activities you do, all the things that you do, what are those activities that influence you the most? It's reading, right? The things we read, the newspaper, the print, the online reading, books, magazines, reading. There's a need to read. Reading has a very shaping, shaping influence in our lives. And so today we're going to celebrate reading and we're going to celebrate the mission of Literacy Advance. Today is our 19th Champions of Literacy event. Uh, we've been holding these events a number of times a year since 2004 so that we can recognize and honor people who have been fantastic literacy advocates uh, here locally in Houston. And then a number of our champions have a uh, far other reach than that. One of the honorees was Comcast for their commitment to literacy in the digital age. Well, especially on the digital literacy front, I think Comcast is continuing to evolve in how we can give back to the community and how we can help. Uh, we had the digital connectors programs uh, last year. This year we're talking a lot about Internet Essentials, which is a program that allows lower income families access to the Internet at a really reduced rate. But the real stars of the event are those who volunteer their time to teach and those who take the courageous step to learn to read in order to better their lives. I moved to the United States four years ago and I didn't speak English at all. It was really stressful for me because uh, I, I have good educational background, but um, here it doesn't mean anything. When you can communicate with people, you're deaf. In addition to improving the reading and writing skills of native English speakers, Literacy Advance provides classes for people whose first language is not English to learn or improve their listening, speaking, reading, and writing skills. It was approximately six years ago, and I didn't know any kind of English at all. Even though maybe I had a lot of goals in life, it, I didn't really have the tools they have decided that this is something that they are capable of and they can change their lives. And by golly, they're going to do it. They have very small classes. And so when you have very few classmates, you have a tutor that is working at the same pace, but at the same time it's more personal and it gives you the ability of learning faster. They are probably working all day long very hard and they still give up at least two evenings a week or maybe a big block of time on Saturday because they want to learn. I admire them very much. I think their dedication is amazing. I want to say that it's never late to start. Please don't give up and continue going forward to your goals because uh, you have to just believe yourself and you believe that People uh, which are around you, they really care and they will be ready to give you hands. Just try it. The programs at Literacy Advance help students achieve their goals. Anna is now on staff at Literacy Advance. Francisco now has his own business and is going to college. So it helps you out in so different ways with your family, opportunities. It gives you the tools to really go forward in life. The mission of Literacy Advance is to transform lives and communities through the doorway of literacy. And each one of us has a chance to participate in that calling. And through the 47 years of continuous service that we've provided here in the Houston community, uh, we have touched tens of thousands of lives. Tens of thousands of lives. Tens and tens and thousands of lives. So I know that I work with all of you here saying that we are very much looking forward to um, working with the next hundreds of thousands of lives. They, the first time they walk in that door of Literacy Advance, they have changed their own lives. Every time they walk through that door, there's change made. And every time the volunteer walks through the door, even if they've had a long day at work or whatever it may be, and they may walk in and they're kind of stressed out, <clears throat> by the time they leave, everybody's laughing and smiling and feeling good and knowing that that change happened. For more information about Literacy Advance, the programs they offer, and how you can lend your support, visit their website at literacyadvance.org. For Comcast Newsmakers On Location, I'm Michael Bybee. Thanks for watching.